Hello everyone, this is Bryce with Timberframe HQ. And in this video, we're going to take a look at some of the Timberframe construction details that you can add to your Timberframe home, not only to make it more unique and intriguing, but more functional as well. These details do not always add more cost to your Timberframe house, but are just some things to think about when in the design phase. So the first one I'd like to talk to you about are the different chamfers you can put on your timber frame. Just for those of you out there that don't know what a chamfer is, it is basically taken off the corners of the timbers to create a rounded or beveled edge. These can be quite intricate as you can see in the photos, or you can make them by hand with a draw knife for a much more organic feel. The timber frame that you decide to go with will be able to show you the different styles close up to help you decide. The second construction detail, and one of the structural ones, are the pegs. While there are a couple different species of pegs, the predominant one is white oak. The other ones being locust or Brazilian cherry. You can always also stain your pegs to have a contrasting color with your frame if you would like to achieve that look. The other aspect about pegs I'd like to talk about is actually how far they stick out. Some folks like them flush with the timbers. Some like them sticking out only an inch. And my personal choice are for them to stick out at least two inches. What can I say? I like the shadow lines that they create. The last thing concerning your pegs is to think about maybe where you want to hang a plant, hang a coat, or a piece of art. You can always have the timber frame bring a couple extra long pegs to achieve this functional aspect of what a peg can do without adding much cost at all. As an example, I was able to put a peg in a post next to our bed so my wife could hang her robe on there so in the middle of the night she could get to it really easy. The last timber frame construction detail that I'd like to discuss is using organic or live edge timbers in your project. Even having just one of these in your frame may turn out to be the focal point of the house simply because of the uniqueness of the piece. It has always amazed me how people walk up to these special timbers just to feel them. I find it just reminds people that the timbers in the house actually came from trees. It makes a special connection with people. So whether one or many, it is something that you may want to think about adding. And I hope the pictures throughout these last couple slides have inspired you to think about such adding such a dynamic piece to your timber frame. Well those are just three of the timber frame construction details that you can add to your timber frame construction project. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any other questions about timber frame construction details that can go into your timber frame project, please visit us at timberframehq.com and don't forget to say hi to us at facebook.com backslash timberframehq. Take care, and we'll see you soon.